getting there. Sorry about that, we've had a couple of technical difficulties, but we'll get on with it now.
here in Australia and I know across the other side of the world I can see we've got people in the UK and in America and how fabulous so joy of the season to you all sorry we're a bit late going on I can't believe that Nick is so calm here at the moment because uh, up to 15 minutes ago he was about to, his head was about to explode <laughs> with the sound anyway here we are so we're going to play you some more music tonight it's a great night tonight because not only are we playing now and if the people in the Southern Hemisphere can stay up late enough, you'll get Dave the Bard in a few hours' time as well. So he's doing his Winter Solstice concert. So, keeping in the theme of the season. Don't you stress Which got his beer on? Jeez. Which is beer season over here. <laughs> it's always beer season over here. Yeah, well, that's true. All right. Thought we'd do that one, right? Energies on the rise from the rainbow pool of flows from the cauldron of the earth from soil and clay the green one grows and the voices of the land join the songs of ancient trees to awaken us from our winter sleep and feel the serpent energy. Hello people from Sussex. My second home is Sussex in the UK. From the waters of her well flow the sacred streams a gifting from the other world Across the plain of dreams, spirits moving water, rock and stone, mother earth, sweet blood and bone. We come to farewell the crown and greet the maiden of the green. Comes the horned one in his bra. 
in his eyes With the maiden he will dance And with the maiden he will sing She'll take his seed The goddess's need And abundance in summer rain And we got a huge thank you to say to Corey, who's doing sound for us, that Thanks, he's mate. doing a wonderful job, and he's yeah, I've thrown him a few curly ones tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Told you to keep your curly ones to yourself, Nick. <laughs> I can't, they're popping out my top. <laughs> so, oh well, Billy says yes. Tracy Lewis says perfect sound. Thanks. Darren Scott, yes. Is Louisa John Kroll still watching? I'd like to thank her for my top tonight. Thank you, Louisa. It's a lovely present. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, Maybe pop them. Pop them. 
so this time of year here in Australia is a time of um, such bounty. It's beautiful. It's so, such lovely things happening at the moment. The weather's perfect. The food's perfect. The fruit is perfect. The wine is perfect. It's brilliant. The, um, Apart from Scott Morrison, it's all wonderful. <laughs> Connecting the Wi-Fi sound to the stereo wasn't quite so perfect, that wasn't perfect. But, um, mm -hmm. but apart from that, we're living with it. Thank you, Serena, over in Melbourne. How are you? <laughs> so a song for summer solstice called Pocket Full of Time. Are you going to get dressed or what? what's happening? Sing a song of summer, a pocket full of time. There's four and twenty magpies perched upon the line. There's hunger if you're drinking and not to make you sigh. There's jerks from the orchard, there's berries from the vine. There's jokes upon the table, filled with really wine. And the briar and the bramble around each other climb. And away you go, away you see what we'll find. In the greenwood at midsummer time. She'll be stepping out with the horn of band. There's plenty bees of buzzing and the air is warm and sweet. We're dancing in the ring of stone, the earth and our feet. Mother Nature's in the glory for the rhythm of the beat. Come away, come away, see what we'll find. Greenwood and in summertime. Come Jack, come home, come roll and be fellow. Step out for measure, we knew we will follow. Thank you, Donna. Hi, Dave Smith. 
Oh, for Dave Smith, that's one of our few songs we play in a major key. There you go. <laughs> Speaking of lovely Dave Smith, um, his concerts tonight, folks, but you probably all know that anyway. But our last time we saw Dave and Kerry, they took us to um, an amazing place. Um, the Smithy. The Smithy. It, it was yeah. called the Long Man Pub. Oh, no, not, <laughs> not that one. Oh, right, okay. So, this, not far. yeah. That's not a pub. Well, it probably is, but we're talking about the actual hillside carving. <laughs> so this is a song about uh, Waylon the Smith. Never stood a hand that forges iron 
So a shout out for our friends in the Northern Hemisphere now for your Yule. So a blessed Yule to you all. I hope it's lovely over there. I know you can't do much at the moment. It's a bit bonkers with this COVID stuff over there. So I hope you're lighting your homes up with all your lovely decorations and enjoying it. Actually, having been brought up in the UK and and, um, obviously living in Australia now, Probably never used to appreciate all all the all the lights and, and and that were there for for that December at the end of the school holidays and, and you know school and you're going into holidays and everybody lit their house up. But living here now when it's you know in the middle of summer and and uh, and it gets light you know it stays light and gets dark so late the kids can't really go out and see them. It, it's just that amazing thing as a as a kid when it's winter and it's dark and you know you went to school in the dark and you're coming home in the dark and everybody's windows are lit up. It's it's that thing that kind of gets you through that that winter time. We don't we don't get it over here, so that's why we put our tree up in in uh, in June. <laughs> so over here, because it, it's it's the winter solstice, and our neighbours think we're mad, but there we go. We still do it. Yeah, but Paul, when you were a kid, yeah. it was all the smog from the coal yeah. fires that were making it. <laughs> well, dark. I had to get up the chimney myself, obviously. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. but yeah. Hi, Ruthie. <laughs> Forest dies into the night. 
Darren Scott, that's a lovely thing to say. And what did Darren Scott say? Not telling. Oh. <laughs> what was the, oh gosh, private. Oh, private. Going all over the place now, I'm going to spring now. <laughs> Mother is out here, Willie, you're going, what are you doing? What are you doing? You're messing with me, messing with my lines.
Doing the gremlins down there, we had Tigger here on the accordion. <laughs> it was weird. Corey put this wonderful effect on, but it sounded like my loop pedal went into motion. I'm sorry if I oh, no. What was the, the start? The cricking is when you clapped, and, and then it came back through my fog back like two seconds later. I'm thinking, where am I? I'm lost. Oh my god. Hello, Tanzan. And so take his beer away, Corey. Take the beer away. <laughs> and John in Tasmania. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> so just recently, well, you all know about the Green album that was released a number of years ago. So just recently, we've re-released it. So there's like there's uh, physical copies available with us again, and with um, I believe with uh, SJ Tucker, and with Twapa Dadana. And you can go to the website and purchase those because we give you another push to make some money to, to, to raise money for Mother Earth through the um, Rainforest Trust. So if you don't have this fabulous album, you need it. The green album, it's beautiful. It has how many artists are on it? 14. 14 of the world's best pagan warblers. And you all know what it's about, don't you, for raising money for the Rainforest Trust. They're, they're, well, they're doing all sorts of projects, but, but for this particular um, Green Album, the money is going towards a project in the Congo, and they've bought the rainforest in the Congo very strategically. So they've built a, or made a land sort of bridge of the forest where nobody can can do the deforestation. So it makes a land bridge for all the animals and uh, and, and basically divides the country in two. So they bought very st strategically, and uh, and was a really smart thing to do. And I forget the hectares that is th thousands and thousands of hectares that they've they've bought, but. Um, uh, they've done really well, but we need more, obviously. We need to protect more of that rainforest. So if you buy the album, 25% uh, goes to the, the Rainforest Trust. Same to you, Donna. Sources, blessings to you, and thank you, John. And that was Saffron, Nick's Kelpie, you heard barking in the background there. Wow. 
There's poetry in the breezes that tell all things to come, like dancing corn and sweet beneath the summer sun. Lay down among the blossoms, sacred to the flower bride, lost in scented fields where meadow sweet runs wild. Lady of the lakes and fields, lady of the woods, I feel your burnt energy rushing through my blood. Your silver skin bark. The summer king has claimed his bride and all be reborn. The spirit of the wildwood calls in the language of the trees. Protect the woodlands of the earth is a forest god's decree. But without the essence of the green, our world can never be. Drawing breath around us from the earth into the leaves. We saw and shoot and stem a root. I leave the path and land. We keep alive the wisdom of the Lord. Singing up the summertime, and you know you'll never look back when the spirit of the green will take you. Hey, oh, it's the green man Jack, a rubber through the woods. Singing up the summertime, and you know you'll never look back when the spirit of the green will take you. So we don't know when we're going to see you all again live in Adelaide. We do have a gig in March, I believe, at the Wheaty. But that's ages away, so we might do another online one of these for you in the summer when it's nice and warm. I must admit I've been a bit slack with our website and things. I must um, get things up to date. This um, event was, was on here, of course, but I don't think I've put the March um, gig on there. Yet, so that's a, a shared gig, I believe, isn't it? With Isadora's Dream, 
um, yes. that's been put off more times than I care to remember because of COVID. <laughs> um, I think we were basically going to play just about every month last year and uh, and it never quite happened. So uh, yeah, hopefully this time we'll, we'll play in March. I think it's something like the 15th or something, but I can't remember now. It's um, yeah, mid-March sometime. I'll update you. So cheers for solstice, everybody. I think those of you, those of you in the Northern Hemisphere are having cups of, cups of coffee and things right now. Is that correct? That time over there? Yeah, it'd be about 11 minutes, wouldn't it? Something like that. Now, we'll see you at the end of this song because we haven't played this song out for many, many, many moons. But it's a, a traditional folk song and Spiral Dance took it and buggered it, really. <laughs> <laughs> As we know to do with traditional folk songs. So it's about a lady who lives there in a castle and she's very, very plump. Hence the line, she could scarcely find her marrow. I thought it was about a vegetable when we first did yeah, I did wonder where it had been. <laughs> Talking <laughs> <laughs> um, of buggering it. <laughs> it's called the Dewey Dells of Yarrow. And um, yeah, wish us luck. There lived a lady in the north. You could scarcely find her marrow. She was courted by nine noble men on the Dewey Dells. And she did love him dearly. She dressed him up like a noble lord for to fight for her on Yarrow. She kissed his cheek, she caved his hair, as all she'd done before. She gilded him with a right good sword for to fight for her on Yarrow. Or did you come here to borrow? Or did you come here with a single sword? For the fight her on Yarrow. I came not here for the drink red wine, and I came not here to borrow. But I come here with a single sword, for the fight her on Yarrow. There are none of you, and none of me, and that's not even the fun. But it's bad to man, I'll fight you all, and I'll fight her.
<laughs> Louise, you're dancing. Louise, John Kroll's dancing, she says. How? You need about seven legs to dance to that. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh, the three neurons? Then. Quite enough of that. So uh, I think we're getting towards the end. I'm sorry for the late start and how that may have affected your day for people who are watching or your evening over in here in Australia, but we do appreciate you watching. And um, it's a free gig, of course, but if you'll um, check the, the, the comments at, at the beginning, we do have our witchy, our witchy buskers hat out. So if you uh, are kind enough to donate, you don't need to, but every little helps for us. Um, to wish us a happy solstice, then there's a PayPal um, address there where you can um, drop us uh, a gold coin or something that would be very very kind thank you so we're going to finish up the song that um, honors this country I'm going to dedicate this to this beautiful land of William Roo Paramount land that we're on tonight this is goddess of the southern land
Thank you, everybody. Have a lovely festive season wherever you are, and a lovely solstice. And to all our friends that are in the Northern Hemisphere, please stay safe. Please stay safe at this time. With COVID raging over there, we're thinking of you all, and hopefully we'll see you all soon. Big thank you to Corey on thank sound you, Corey. as well. Thanks for all your help Bless tonight. Bless you all. Bye bye. Beautiful. Thank you, Dave. Have a great gig later on tonight, Dave. <laughs> Paulie, Paulie, yeah. can you grab the? I'll turn it off. There you go.